You will know how to download and install the Crackers with Destroy Mod Replica add-on for PC and Android by watching this video. So guys, I'll be leaving the link in the description down below for the Crackers with a Storm replica add-on. It is a media fire link, so just click on the blue download button as you guys can see. It may not ask you where to save it, but here it says save as, and there you go. Save it in your downloads folder, that's probably where it automatically saves it to. Now that the download is done, go to your file explorer, go to your downloads folder, and you guys will see the newly downloaded file. Left click on it, right click. Click on rename and then go to the end of the file by just left clicking. Press backspace on your keyboard to rename the .zip to a .mc add-on. Press enter and then click on yes. Now what you need to do is to just double tap or double click on it. <laughs> if you're using a touch screen on your probably laptop, that would be amazing. You know, you could actually double tap, but we're using a mouse right here. Okay, so we double click. That's pretty much the general public right now using a mouse okay i'm not sure maybe in the future i'm again like this huh? is just a tutorial why am i getting into like the future and then there you go let's see hopefully it does import properly there you go successfully imported cws bp resource pack and behavior pack made by the tainted team check go to your settings scroll down to storage Go to resource packs tab and behavior packs tab and as you guys can see, it is downloaded and imported actually. It's imported. We downloaded it early. For Android, the link for this is in the description. Again, click on the mini download icon. It'll say downloading file. There you go. Once file is downloaded and make sure you do not click on a pop-up that says download, download.apk because we're not downloading a .apk. We're downloading a .zip. Proceed to your home screen, go to the Google Play Store, click on that search box, type in Z Archiver, press on the search icon, and then download the Z Archiver made by Z Devs. Click on install on the right. After install, click on enable if it allows you to, and then click on open. It'll ask for permission, so click on OK. Slide this toggle to allow access to manage all files. Click on the left arrow. And then you're here in Z Archiver. Click on zero and go click on device storage to make sure you're in where the downloads folder is in. Go to your download folder. Now you'll have the CWSMR file. Hold down on it. Tap on rename. Go to the end of the file and rename the .zip to a .mc add-on. Like this. And then click on O or tap on OK. Now tap on the .mc add-on file. Click on the diagonal arrow. And then tap on Minecraft, then tap on Always. There you go. It'll open up Minecraft. So hopefully it doesn't really crash with the other Witherstorm add-ons. Let's see if it imports successfully. There you go. Okay, successfully imported CWSBP resource pack and behavior pack. What is this? I'm not this. This skin. But to check, go to your settings. Scroll down on the left until you go to storage. Tap on behavior packs and you'll see... The CWSBP behavior pack here. Scroll down even further and then go to resource packs and you'll see the CWSBP resource pack here as well. Now what you need to do is just click on play, create new. After create new world, scroll down to resource packs, go to the available tab and under the own tab, you guys will see the activate button for the CWSBP replica add-on. Just click on the activate button. There you go. And then after that, go to the active tab to make sure it's activated. Go to the behavior packs on the left and then go to the available tab once again and find the CWSMR here and click on the activate button. Now go down to experiments on the left again and then scroll down to where it says add on creators and then just tap or probably click on anything here and then turn on experiments anyway, okay? You can turn on all the experiments or all the add on creators features here. I recommend just turning on these five not experimental cameras because I don't know what it will do to the wither storm. Click on create as well. There you go. Now what you can do is just type forward slash summon the ender dragon. 
There you go. Very, very awesome. So if this tutorial helped you out, make sure you guys do a super thanks. Just click the super thanks button there. It will really mean a lot if you guys do that. Subscribe, ring that notification bell icon, and set it to all so you guys don't miss any Witherstorm videos or videos like this one right here. Like and share this video if you guys want to help other people out install the CWSMR add-on. And also if you guys also want to support my channel and help me grow it faster and to increase your support make sure you guys become a channel member by clicking the join button below you guys can become a channel member by paying one dollar per month and you guys will get exclusive posts videos behind the scenes content from me but if you guys want to keep watching click on this video that you guys see on your screens right now i hope you guys stay safe all praise to the most high read the bible verse somewhere on the screen and i'll see you guys in the next video Bye bye